Well, good afternoon, everybody. The sun is out, and I'm going to take a photo, a video of our uh, generator. And uh, I made a mistake before in recording it. They wanted in landscape, so here we go. Okay, I bought this Chromtech Outback generator from CaravanRVCamping.com, and um, yeah, I want to just share with you what I think about this unit. Uh, we've taken it in our caravan, our nice new caravan. And this uh, generator, it just runs so well. Okay, did a lot of homework to start with. And um, I have found that this is the best value for money that I can get from uh, Chromtech, who is uh, sold by an Australian highly reputable company without paying top dollar for it. I've got great value for money here. So let's have a look at the generator and I'll even start it up for you. I haven't uh, started it for a day or two, and we'll see how we go. Okay, here we go. The Chromtech generator. Got a beautiful cover. So let's take that off. Here we go, and I'll put that here behind the rock. And here is the generator. It's beautifully made, a nice shiny finish. It's easy to keep clean. It's very sturdy. I mean, you can put this on its side and everything. And um, without the fuel dripping out, because it's got this fuel cap here with a mesh filter inside. I hope I'm recording all this properly. There you go, to keep everything nice and clean. And when you close it, you can actually lock it so that if it falls over or something for some reason, your fuel is not going to run out and create a security situation. Okay, to turn it on, you've got off and on. So I'll turn it on now because I'm going to start it up soon. Okay, this is a two and a half kilowatt unit, which is more than ample to run air cons, etc. And everything in our van. We've got all the mod cons in our new van here, and uh, yeah, it's just great. Okay, got an on off switch here. And I'll just introduce you to all the features. It's got a start rope here, 12 volt outlet here. Of course, it's got a nice dust cap on it too. And next to it, I've got double USB. It's got two 15 amp power points here, which is really handy. Uh, reset buttons, all the stuff that's necessary. It's got a choke to use for starting. On top of that you've got LED lights, you know exactly what's going on. And you've got this little, little rocker switch here for auto idle or for running at high speed all the time. So this really cuts in. When you use a lot of power it revs up. When you're not using a lot of power it idles slower. Uh, the fuel tank holds enough fuel to run about six hours. And so yeah this is it. Chromtech Outback. I'll show you the side. Air filters here. A little exhaust here. Oh, where is it? Here. It's only very small. And this is easy enough to lift with a couple of fingers. How's that? So that's a quick intro. Now, I'm going to start this up for you. I'll do it with my other hand. So the first thing is you turn this on. Right? You pull the choke out. Make sure this is turned to on so the air can get in and replace the fuel you use. And I'll give it a couple of pulls and see how we go. Oh, how's that? That that first go, I can't believe it. That's me sitting there for a couple of days. Push the choke in and Bob's your uncle. Now you notice outside, I'm now two meters away from it. I can't hear it. I must be deaf. <laughs> so, very happy with this. I must try and use my welder on this sometime, but I'll tell you, there's more power here than what you need. It's just perfect combination. To turn it off, you just turn this off. And turn this to off, and there you go. So that's my Chromtech Outback. 
I'm very, very happy with this. Look, I got mine from Caravan RV uh, and Camping.com, and uh, they've given great service too. So, if you're in a market or looking around for a good Jenny with heaps of power, dynamic power, uh, you can't go past this. And I highly recommend it. So thank you for watching this and I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it helps you to make a decision if you're in the market for a generator. There you go. Enjoy camping.